this demonstration, you'll learn how to perform the installation for ANSYS Electronics Release 18 on the Linux platform. Before proceeding, close all ANSYS applications. Download the ANSYS product files from the ANSYS customer portal. Have administrator access to the installation. Extract the product file to an accessible directory. And note the host name and port of your licensed server machine. This tutorial will begin in the location of the ANSYS CM18 product extracted files. Run install batch script as root user. This brings up the ANSYS Electromagnetics installation shell screen. The installation shell presents a list of all the software included in the full package. Electromagnetics RSM can be installed if you need to configure distributed solves to a remote machine without using a scheduler. Layout integrations for ECAD adds ANSYS A-Links menu items in third-party layout tools. For now, click Install Electromagnetic Suite. This launches the ANSYS Electromagnetic Suite Linux 64-bit edition dialog. Click Next to continue. Read the ClickWrap software license agreement completely. If you agree to the terms, select the Accept the Terms box. Click Next to proceed with the installation. Enter the username that will own the software. This user will need to have sufficient privileges to write to the specified installation directory. Select Next. Now you can choose where to install the ANSYS EM products on your computer. Accept the default installation directory or you may enter your own directory. Click Next to continue. Next specify the temporary directory location. This directory will be used as scratch space for the solvers to do their work. So it should be on a fast local disk with adequate free space. We'll just accept the default here and select Next to continue. Most users will use the local library option. However, if you're working in an environment with a shared set of common libraries, you can set that up here. Select the local installation and click Next to continue. Next, you need to tell the software how to find licensing. You will select from one of the three options. If you have an ANSYS provided license and want to set the reference based on it, select I have a new license file. If you know the machine hostname and port of the license server machine, select I want to specify a license server. If you already have licensing set up from a prior ANSYS EM release and want to keep that same configuration, select I want to keep the current license configuration. We'll set up licensing specifying the license server. Select I want to specify a license server. Specify the license server computer hostname. If your organization is running a redundant triad server configuration, then select Specify Redundant Servers option and enter the names of all three servers. The idea of the redundant server is to maintain license availability in the event of a hardware failure on one licensed server. If you're not sure you are using a single or redundant licensed server, check with your system administrator. Select Specify Server TCP IP Port Number box. You will then enter the TCP IP port number that the license manager is running on. The ANSYS License Manager uses port 1055 by default, but your organization may change that. Check with your systems administrator if you are not sure. Select Next to continue. Select No. Do not install the USB Flex 9 driver. Click Next to continue. Now ensure other ANSYS applications are closed and review these settings. Notice this dialog gives required disk space. If you are satisfied with the settings, Click Next to complete the installation. The Install Shield wizard now installs the ANSYS Electromagnetic Suite. This may take a little while. Click OK to continue. Click OK to continue. After installation completes, press Finish and exit the dialog. The original installation shell window appears now. Press Exit to complete the installation. You can now start the ANSYS Electronics Desktop Release 18.0 by running the specified installation path forward slash ANSYS EDT. Press OK for the following series of prompts. This concludes the installation demonstration of the ANSYS Electromagnetic Suite 18.0 on the Linux platform.